My role as chaplain has changed uh, significantly during COVID-19. On Friday nights, we usually have our Christian fellowship in the chapel and we've had to move that to the Zoom platform. That has actually worked really well though because students that are off campus at the moment and back home have still been able to join in community. Secondly, face-to-face -face pastoral care catch-ups um, were a bit trickier at the start when the, the limits were stronger. Now that that's kind of like back to one-on-one -on -one and um, a couple of people visiting, it's become a lot easier, but we made sure that we continued those pastoral care catch-ups through FaceTime and through Messenger. And we really are blessed to live in a day and age that has technology like that to be able to actually maintain pastoral care. So it was challenging um, to make sure that we're still creating this community and taking care of students' needs um, pastorally. But I think that during COVID-19, moving to those online platforms has really helped. For me, being a chaplain in this season has been critical. You know, students' anxiety is going through the roof because they're worried, they're concerned about legitimate things, the unknown of COVID-19, what that might bring for their family, finances, friends, for their education. And so it's been really good just to be a listening ear and to support them and just hear their concerns um, and pray with them. And I'm not alone in that. We have a beautiful Red Frogs team that comes in and has been doing Zoom activities and hangouts to try and keep things fun and engaging for them while they're at college and keep their mind off some things. And as you know, my husband Michael and I chaplain kind of together. And so he's been also helping a lot to, um, yeah, just be another listening ear um, for the students. It is really important that we have faith during this uncertain time because we have hope and it means that we know that this uncertain time has an end and not only does it have an end, there is someone who knows how it ends and so that is where we get our hope from in knowing that God is with us through this and he'll be with us after this and I think that that is a beautiful thing.